So our fourth race this evening, again over fences, the pure-protection.co.uk, insurance for health, wealth, life, novices limited handicap chase. And four set to line up. The bomber Liston is leading the way to the start. Colours of J.P. McManus, trained by Nicky Henderson, Nico de Boinville in the green and yellow hoops with a white cap. That is for the bomber Liston. The dark blue and white, the colours of owner-breeder Mr. Bob Barrett. This is my Bobby Dazzler. My Bobby Dazzler is trained by Mel Rowley and Alex Edwards is aboard. Silver Sheen, the red colours with the black pinstripe sleeves and a horse logo on the jacket of the Turner family, Fergal O'Brien and Paddy Brennan. That is number three, Silver Sheen. And the grey is one Martello Sky, owned by the Sky Partnership, trained by Dr Richard Newland and ridden by Sam Twiston-Davies, the black with a white star, the grey mare, Martello Sky. Betting has my Bobby Dazzler as the now well-backed 15 to 8 favourite. The Bomber Liston is at 2 to 1. It's 7 to 2, easy to back Martello Sky. And Silver Sheen is also on the slide at 9 to 2. The pureprotection.co.uk, insurance for health, wealth and life. Novices Limited Handicap Chase, post time of 6.50, is nearly upon us. So Martello Sky had a terrific career for, for Lucy Wadham. I won eight races and has changed yards quite recently. Um, to join Richard Newland. Didn't run badly at Utox at the end of May. It was her first chase. It was a match. Um, so she was last of two, but she gave it a good go. And um, I think dropping in trip is probably a, a good thing for her. But she's got to give weight away here. The bomber Liston could be interesting after a, a wind operation. Silver Sheen has also had a wind up since last running, but hasn't won a race for three and a half years. Now, that only encompasses 11 races, but he's got a little bit to prove, Silver Sheen. And he was on his toes beforehand. Uh, I, I, I think um, my Bobby Dazzler's got a great chance here if he takes to the fences. He has got point-to-point -point experience. He ran very well in a good race at Cartmel at the end of May, and he does stay further than two and a half. He, he could be a tough nut to crack here. So they are a bit behind time here. I know we had the last quarter was injured at the end of the previous race, and that's perhaps made us um, a little bit behind time. Unfortunately, he couldn't be saved, sadly, last quarter. Uh, broke down after the fifth last. So the runners are now in the position where they need to be. Um, my Bobby Daz looking very much like jumping off in front. So seven to four, my Bobby Dazzler. Fifteen to eight, the Bomber Liston, and it's four to one, Silver Sheen, and nine to two, Martello Sky.
So the starters got to the top of the rostrum. Has been, and he ran very well at Cartmel last time. That was obviously over three miles. But looking like making use of his stamina, jumping off at the front. We'll see what happens. Right, in they come for our fourth race of the evening. And they slowly advance on the tape. Sophie Upton waiting, and they're off. In the pure-protection.co.uk, insurance for health, wealth, life, novices limited handicap chase. And they're running towards the first of 13. My Bobby Dazzler on the inside of Silver Sheen. And on the outer is the Bomber Liston. These are the front three with Martello Sky the Grey just waiting in behind. As they reach the first, my Bobby Dazzler led Silver Sheen with the Bomber Liston. A little bit novicey at the first. It's his debut over fences today. And unlike my Bobby Dazzler, who's also running over fences for the first time, he doesn't have previous point-to-point -point experience. In fourth place is Martello Sky, the best-turned-out winner with Sam Twiston Davies aboard. But it's my Bobby Dazzler and Alex Edwards leading by three-quarters of a length to Silver Sheen in second place. And then the Bomber Liston and Nico de Boinville on the outside of Martello Sky. So there's only two and a half to three lengths separating the quartet here as they turn into the home straight and run towards their second fence of the 13. My Bobby Dazzler, he leads. And over that to... And unseating the Bomber Liston. Catapulted Nico de Boinville out of the saddle at that. He really didn't have a prayer. So we're down to three. The other three have cleared the open ditch. And uh, Nico is on his feet. And the Bomber Liston seemingly none the worse as the other three jump fence number four. And it's My Bobby Dazzler to Silver Sheen and Martello Sky in third place. My Bobby Dazzler gave that plenty of daylight. Silver Sheen is in second position on the inside. And then the grey mare Martello Sky. And they're being followed by the loose, the Bomber Liston. So My Bobby Dazzler, three times a winner. With Silver Sheen getting closer on the inside now under Paddy Brennan, who hasn't won a race, Silver Sheen, for getting on for three and a half years. But that does only take in 11 races in that uh, lengthy period of time. It's half a length adrift of the leader, my Bobby Dazzler, with Martello Sky waiting in third place as they run to the end of the home straight. My Bobby Dazzler on the outside of Silver Sheen. Martello Sky is in third. Her second run over fences tonight. Eight times a winner for her previous trainer, Lucy Wadham, including picking up plenty of black type as well. She's had a fabulous career to this point, Martello Sky. They've entered the back straight. And they're about to go past the cathedral and run on towards fence number six. My Bobby Dazzler just to Silver Sheen as they come to take off at this. And they matched one another there. Silver Sheen on the inside of My Bobby Dazzler. It's four lengths then to Martello Sky in third place. They're about to run past the stables. Coming to fence number seven. Silver Sheen on the inner of My Bobby Dazzler, who uh, got over that okay. Martello Sky is waiting just about three lengths off them in third. Two more to take in the back straight. And then the four in the home straight. My Bobby Dazzler, the dark blue and white, asked for a, a big jump on the inside. Silver Sheen, who came up nicely for Patty Brennan. Martello Sky, she is still in third. So going through their starting point and heading towards the fifth last. My Bobby Dazzler. On the inside is Silver Sheen. Martello Sky in third. My Bobby Dazzler, Silver Sheen. Two lengths to Martello Sky, who's more than close enough in third place. So a lengthy run on the flat now before they get to four out. Silver Sheen on the inside. On the outer is My Bobby Dazzler. And Martello Sky is right on their tail in third place. This is the pure-protection.co.uk. Insurance for health, wealth, life. Novices Limited Handicap Chase. Silver Sheen on the inside of My Bobby Dazzler. They match strides with Martello Sky waiting in the wings in third place. Not much ground separating the three of them. 
as they approach the fence where we lost the bomber Liston on the first circuit. Alex Edwards just starting to ask for a bit more on my Bobby Dazzler. A big jump needed from Silver Sheen on the inside. It wasn't big, but it was fast. Silver Sheen, my Bobby Dazzler. Martello Sky two lengths away in 33rd last. Silver Sheen to my Bobby Dazzler. Martello Sky are now asked to pick up the near side. Three of them in with a chance as they run to the second last. Silver Sheen, though, has gone on by three to my Bobby Dazzler with Martello Sky not particularly quick there in third as they run to the last. My Bobby Dazzler trying to come back at Silver Sheen. Silver Sheen by two to My Bobby Dazzler. Martello Sky in third. Paddy Brennan and Silver Sheen. My Bobby Dazzler who stays further. Coming right back on this near side under Alex Edwards. My Bobby Dazzler to Silver Sheen. They run to the last half furlong. My Bobby Dazzler pounding on with the advantage here to Silver Sheen in second. And My Bobby Dazzler is going to make a winning start over fences for Mel Rowley and owner breeder Mr. Bob Barrett. Second Silver Sheen and Martello Sky couldn't strike a blow in third.